All right. Happy anniversary, days of our lives. 53 <laughs> years old. 53 years, young. that's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. I gotta raise the prices here. So I know. Really, oh, that's yeah. gonna be like 30 really bucks good. a bottle. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Well, yeah. your new counter, you know. I know, exactly. I'm glad you guys could come. Yes. On on such a wonderful day as we're celebrating our anniversary, it's a, it's it's bittersweet because we we lost one of our beloved cast members a couple weeks ago, and she was the matriarch of the Brady family and a friend and the beautiful Peggy McKay. We we lost her, and yeah. I know she would love the fact that we were sitting around here having chowder. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes. Right? Right? Oh, my I mean, goodness. she'd be very happy. She'd, she'd be would. happy. Peggy. My first experience with Peggy was when I first came to the show. I think I had maybe said four or five words to her. And my wife and I had just opened up uh, a kid's gym, a small little business in Studio Aww. City. And the first day of our opening, she showed up. Did she? She came and oh she walked wow. in with her hands in the air and she said, Eric! <laughs> Peggy, right? And she, she hugged me and, and I said, Peggy, I wasn't expecting you to be here. And she looked at me and she went, what do you talk, we're family. Oh, and oh my gosh. at that moment, I realized that it didn't matter whether I had been on the show for two weeks or two years or 20 years. Exactly. Days was her family, and yeah. I was a member automatically, Absolutely. and I, I loved that about her. And I'll always yeah. remember that. I'll always yeah. remember that. How about you, Josh? You got a memory of Peggy? Yeah, well, I'm, I'm going to talk more about her as an actress. She went through some tough times as she got older, and, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. then, and wasn't always at the top of game health wise. But it never, it didn't matter yeah. because she Why always did her homework. Right. She was such yeah. a pro. She That's always did her right. homework. Absolutely. She was always prepared. Yeah. And even if she was having problems, for the minute that red light went on. Is that amazing about her? Yes. Absolutely. I, I always felt like she made every yeah. sentence a, a symphony, for lack of a better word. Like yeah. she made the most out of every yeah. word. Yeah. You never knew what was going to come out Absolutely. of it. Absolutely. I was always so impressed with that. That no matter yeah. what was going on, or the yeah. rehearsals could be crazy or whatever, but when we don't really say roll them here, but you know, roll them. Action, action. That she was so yeah. spot on and would get through these huge, huge speeches. And yeah. Yeah. I mean, even now when we do our Thanksgiving or different things, mm. the last couple of years when she hasn't been here, it's been painful because yeah. yes. she is our matriarch. Uh, I'm so idealistic that. I, I sort of believe these characters and the story, and mm -hmm. and I came on the show in 1986, and they, uh, Frank Parker, who passed recently too, but um, and Peggy, they were the parents of the four yeah. Brady kids, right. and the the Hortons and the Bradys and the and the um, generations of these family. Mm -hmm. This was the core of the show, and I still live that. And I when I went to her funeral recently, I just. I felt that. I felt like she is a mother to me. And mm -hmm. she may not have had kids herself, but she was a mother and a grandmother and a great grandmother. And I think all of us felt yeah. that here. We did. And um, the yeah. passion that she put into every performance. Mm -hmm. And I, I joke, but whenever I'm in the Brady pub, she was the queen of of business and always got her towel over here and her coffee. <laughs> I and felt it. like she owned this place. Yeah, she absolutely. Did. absolutely. She, did. She, did. She, no, she, it. Hers. she embodied that character. When she came in, she yeah. embodied that character. And she absolutely, mm -hmm. she was the mother. And Peter, you know, who played Bo, her son, also he said in a tweet that when he looked in her eyes, all he saw was a mother's love. And I, I think yeah. that's so true, and mm -hmm. I believe that yeah. too. And I love Peggy. I think we all love Peggy. Yes. And, um, I haven't really been sad from her passing because I think she had such an incredible life. She was still doing the Mama Brady rap thing <laughs> in the <her> wheelchair. <laughs> She's okay. amazing. I, know. And, um, yeah. I don't think oh, so. God. And yeah. we all love oh. her. And, and I you think back when we had that pivotal wedding where Will yes. and Sonny got married, yes. I was still newer to the show then. Mm -hmm. And I think one of the most nerve wracking things is when you have all of your idols who you've you've watched grow up in this show who are in the audience watching you get married. So it's like all eyes on you when yeah. you're getting married on this show yes. and you're performing monologues. Yes. Oh, exactly. And I was still new on the show. <laughs> I still hate that. It's, it's the hardest one. <laughs> right. Everyone's, everyone's, everyone's looking watching. at you. Yeah. And, uh, you mess up. You always say nobody's watching. Judging. Yeah, yeah but they're right, like staring. Right. So I was I was I was up there and and I just you know got into character and I was I was you know doing the vows and everything. I got to hear from a lot of different actors and watch. And then Peggy comes up and that that was the most memorable moment mm -hmm. of, oh, of her incredible. giving this four or five page monologue about such 
a important topic and she Absolutely. was sharing her love and experience and it was amazing and um, and it was her acting that actually made my acting better mm -hmm. which is like what we can all do for one another is like mm -hmm. if we can make exactly. the other actor feel yeah. something exactly. and I was I had genuine Absolutely. tears from her performance and uh, you know but I'll take the credit as the actor <laughs> getting that <laughs> chair. I, I feel like you were really good you know what, Freddie? I think she challenge. probably was going to have a hard time, but you got her through it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 we'll go with that one. Yeah. 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 I had well. forgotten that to you, man. That was extraordinary. She blew me away. Felt it so deeply. But I do, I do think you, you all helped because that was a moment where all of you were so involved and invested. And it was such a pivotal moment of our show too for branching out and and stretching those boundaries of our program. Sure. And yet you have the matriarch right. as the glue that's bringing right. the past and so into the present. Yeah. And yeah. Yes. Absolutely. Yes. it was, it was sure. a beautiful moment right. for our show right. as an evolution right. of it as well. And then I when thought. she went on to play the Alzheimer's story, oh, amazing, oh. Heartbreaking. Oh. Yeah. heartbreaking. That for me I've is got, her I've daughter got, on the show. I've got a funny story that, that kind of shows her resilience, her toughness, and her sense of humor. It was like, and it was a couple years ago, and it was Deidre and I, and Peggy, we're, going, we're doing a scene together, and we walked over to the set. It was over around there. And we were walking and talking, and there was a step up on the set. And she tripped and went down hard. Mm -hmm. And she fell. And, and having watched a lot of hospital TV movies, no, I knew that you know, she had hit her head <laughs> and played some football. But I knew that she had hit her head pretty good, and she was down. And so I wanted to say, Peggy, talk to me, talk to me, you know, yeah. to keep her awake. Sure. And, yeah. and yeah. Dee came down here to this sure. side, sure. and we're talking to her. I'm saying, we got the AMPs right. calling. But we, you know, everything's cool. Just stay with me, talk yeah. to me, talk to me. And then finally, she kind of got her bearings, and she looked at me, and she goes, what happened? Oh. And Dee says, Josh pushed you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who laughed louder, me or Peggy. And Peggy started laughing, and she went, Oh, Deidre. Oh, <laughs> and we knew she was good. Oh. We knew she was yeah. good. How about you, Suzanne? Well, you know, when I heard that Peggy passed away, I, I, for some reason, I just started writing her name. I just wrote her name. And I was trying to think of the piece to me was petite and perfect, and E was energy, and the G was gracious, and the other G was giving, and the Y was young at heart. And that's wow. what she was to mm -hmm. me. She was young at heart, her soul and her heart that were so big, and that's what she passed on to all of us. Yeah. That's so you know, I, I uh, remember, uh, I, I uh, watch a lot of, uh, Tell them old, old TV, like yes. Gunsmokes and, yes. and uh, Andy Griffith. And I'd see Peggy. I'd see Peggy yes. on these shows, this very young, mm -hmm. lovely actress. And yes. I'd see her on these old mm -hmm. black and white TV shows. You know, and I would come back in and say, Peggy, I saw you on, on this, or I saw you on that. And how was it? How was this fangirl. actor? And how, yeah. Yeah, yeah, exactly, Aww. I was. And how was this? You know, because I, I love the history sure. of this business. Sure. I love knowing she has about a heck all of a that. Resume, and she's yes. got a tremendous Whoa. resume. Yes. And she would tell me, oh, yes, I did this on Gunsmoke, and this yeah. happened, and, and I was hurt when I was doing this. And then uh, the Andy Griffith show, and she said, "Oh, he was so handsome." <laughs> she had this huge crush on <laughs> uh, Andy Griffith. And I, just, oh, I, I loved I love every it. one of I those moments. It. He was so yeah, handsome. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, know, I know most people uh, know her as Caroline Brady on our show, and uh, we have actually uh, some clips. Would you guys oh. like to see some of her, uh, I would, yes, her moments? Me Let's too. Let's reminisce, Me too. all of us. Yes. And it hit me. That was James' family. Then I knew for the first time for sure that the moment you were talking about. Yeah, yeah, this is that. Came. Exactly. But it never occurred to me mm. what it cost them. I don't know which one of them broke my heart most. But in the end, I knew who the real loser was, because that family, because Jimmy, he didn't laugh. He barely spoke. Their son, brother, 
was a stranger to them. So, when Will and Sonny came to me, I knew that they were nervous. <laughs> but I said to myself, hallelujah, this is a world <laughs> where we can really know who our precious boys are. And they can really love each other and be who they are. Congratulations, Will. And so, I wish you a lifetime of laughter. I love her. Of the command. Yeah, yeah. she's a yes. <laughs> <laughs> If you live long Sassy enough, spitfire. that might come in handy. <laughs> <laughs> One day the Lord will be kind enough to let you forgive me because I don't think I, I don't think I live without you. Is that the pub? Very yeah. lucky. It looks a little different. Yeah. Have you all? I think that we're the ones that are lucky. <laughs> Who was that? Look at you. <laughs> Whoa. There she is. Ten thumbs up. Yeah. Yeah. Twelve Absolutely. thumbs up. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Not too good on that. Ladies and gentlemen, I think uh, I think we need a toast. Let's yeah. cheers okay. to this lady. Good idea. Let's go ahead and do it. Here we go. Oh. All right. Mm. Oh, thank you. Come and get them. Yeah. Oh. Go. Well, <laughs> to the great. Peggy McKay. Peggy McKay. Peggy. 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 Mama. Peggy. Peggy. When Irish eyes are smiling, sure there is like a morning spring. It's been a long time. In, In the land of Irish, Irish laughter, you can hear the angels sing. When Irish hearts are happy, and the world seems bright and gay. And when Irish eyes are smiling, sure they'll steal your heart and all away. To Peggy, To Peggy. To Peggy. We love you, Mama. We're here. Mm.